about a situation that I have encountered recently involving external hard drives and USB storage. There's a problem and the problem is that it doesn't last forever as I found out. You need to keep an eye on how you're storing your photos and any other data. Most people today are taking pictures and whatnot with their phones and then that automatically goes up to the cloud. That's great. But for those of us who still use USBs, external hard drives, such as myself, you can run into problems if you assume that these devices will last forever, like I did. And recently, I went to go and see what was on one of my old external hard drives. Now on this external hard drive of mine, there's over a terabyte of photos. I had moved them off my computer onto this drive and put this drive into a nice dry, dark drawer five years ago. And there it sat for five years, nice and safe, or so I thought, and that's not the case. Five years later, we're in a pandemic. I decide I'm gonna start clearing out my house and I come across this drive in my drawer where I'd last left it. I plug it into my computer and it's not recognizable. What happened was the drive started to break down. There was also a USB in the same drawer and I attempted to view the pictures on the USB. Now I was able to see the pictures on the USB but they were all very distorted. No saving the pictures on this. I ended up having to take my external hard drive to Canada Computers and the staff there are fantastic. They gave me my options. They were telling me at the time, initially, it could be anywhere from $200 all the way up to $3,000, depending on how it was that they were gonna be able to extract all the files and then recopy them onto a new drive. My situation wasn't so bad. It ended up that they were able to work their magic, however they do that, and they were able to retrieve the files and transfer them over to a new hard drive at the cost of $465, which is an ouch. Certainly a lot better than the $3,000 alternative had they had to take a more forensic approach and send it to a lab in Toronto. The moral of the story is these things don't last forever. Make sure you're using the cloud and this and make sure that you are updating these and replacing them out and recopying to nice new drives. Well, I'm gonna do it every two years. Um, that's my message. Make sure you check them, make sure you recopy them, make sure you have a third source being the cloud and you should be all good. Don't end up like me, don't end up paying hundreds of dollars for data recovery when you can just keep up on it yourself. Thanks everyone.